Kendall from Wingman on the Road here. Um, I'm just going to show you our product, the Goose, and how to set it up. It's super, super easy. You've got a canvas tent, foam mattress, sleeping bag. It all rolls up into a big top. Uh, let's show you how it's done. So this cover acts as your ground sheet for keeping your gear dry underneath the awning. Okay, so you've got two, two poles and poles, so they're both the same length, so you can't get confused. And they just pass through the canvas slider here. The next step is this telescopic pole that goes in the middle that gives you the tension and keeps the tent up. So now you're done. You can sleep in it like this, no problem. If you're on gravel and you, and you can't peg it out, no problem, you can sleep in it like this. If you don't want it near your bike, same again. Um, if you did want to attach it to your bike to create that awning, this is what you do. You've got multiple eyelets, so you can attach it wherever you want which makes it pretty adaptable to any kind of bike you've got. You can have it close to the bike to cover the seat and give you a bit of protection, have a dry seat in the morning. Or you can also have it a bit further away and then you have more of the uh, awning space underneath. Nice old Honda there. Okay. So you've, um, you've got these end flaps as well, which have helmet hooks underneath them, so you can keep your helmet out of sight and dry.
So that's it, you're done. Okay, so now we're set up, I can run you through a couple of the features. We've got multiple eyelets here. Um, so if you're attaching it to different bikes, it makes it really easy to attach to different points. What it also allows you to do is um, set it up for different weather conditions. So before it was a fair weather to light rain setup. This is a more heavy rain setup. Um, I've attached high on the bike here and low on the spoke here, or as I've done, just, um, just attach it to a peg at the bottom there. But the main thing is to create a natural fall line for the rain to go and you can keep all your stuff under here and it'll keep dry. Another option you've got as well is you can wrap things up in this waterproof cover um, and put it under there as well. This is 100% waterproof, so if you wrap everything up there, put it in here, no chance of anything getting, uh, getting wet there. Another cool feature, we've got a helmet hut. Underneath this beak here, So this will keep your helmet hidden and also dry. Inside we've got fly nets on both sides. And this is the canvas door for this side. You've got a foam mattress and sleeping bag that is always in here and you keep it inside. And that's about it. So um, thanks for tuning in and um, this is the case.